Hello everyone, it's Allie from Titan and welcome back to our channel. I am here with our second opening of the evening and we're going to be getting into a very quick rip here of one 2021 Leaf Autograph Mini Helmet Football Edition. So, excited to go ahead and check this out. This here is for Chris R. from Tennessee. So thank you so much, Chris. Now let me open up some football for you here on the channel. Hope to find you a mini helmet that you love adding to your collection. Now opening up some baseball for Chris in the past. He said that his favorite team is the Braves. So not sure if we're aiming for a Falcons helmet or being from Tennessee, if we're aiming for maybe a Titans helmet or just anything really cool in general. But I've been really enjoying the mini helmets. We've checked out TriStar Hidden Treasures before. We checked out last year's Leaf, this year's Leaf a little bit. One thing that I honestly did not realize until one of our streams a couple weeks ago, two or three weeks ago, is everything looks normal here. And then Leaf just flipped everything for the top. So all the top elements, autographs, and team logos are just backwards. I don't know who approved this. I mean, you know what? As long as the product's good, it's not a big deal, but like, bruh. Anyways, just pointing it out because it took way too long for me to notice. I didn't notice until someone in chat pointed it out to me, and that wasn't the first time we've opened this. So just thought I'd pass it along that all these helmets are backwards. Anyways, enough about that. Let's go ahead and jump on into this here for Chris by snapping us into the corner. And I'll show you guys. See, at first someone noticed that this logo here is backwards, and I was like, wait a minute. All the signatures are backwards. So instead of just getting different, you know, like taking a picture of the different side of the helmet, they just took these images and just, they just mirrored it. I don't, I don't know why. I don't know why, but it's funny. I, I honestly, it, it, I'm ashamed of myself for not noticing. Anyways, though, let's go ahead and slice on into this box here. Now I'll take off the shrink wrap and then I'll have to cut like right here. I'll grab the handy dandy scissors uh, because there is like the little, not a latch, but the, uh, a little piece of paper that you stick in and the, the stickers right on top of it so you actually have to cut it off in case you're opening up one of these and you're like why is this so difficult to open that would be why that would be why see the little little thingy you stick in there the stickers on top you do actually have to cut it off i have used scissors before to take or the uh, tiny knife it takes way too long it's just easier to go ahead and cut that but hey you know what you know it hasn't been messed with because there's no way to open this without actually just right all the way through. But all right, so one autograph mini helmet inside. Let's see. We've seen some really cool color variation helmets before. Haven't seen any like the big names on top, like the Tom Brady or anything like that, who is questionably retired, but not, but yes. I don't know what's going on with that. But anyways, who do we have here? And we got black and red. Zach Moss. Okay, interesting. So is this another one of those alt helmets that's pretty neat i've really enjoyed these eclipse ones so for the bills here we have zach moss all right interesting so this is the eclipse alternate here that is cool and i like how it stands out there with the bright white on the black so that's pretty neat there and then of course it is authenticated by beckett there is the sticker with the qr code you can scan does it have a card? Sometimes they have little cards as well. This one does not, but it does have the sticker there. That gives you all the information you need. You just check on the Beckett website, scan the code, get your little authentication piece uh, digitally. That is a cool looking helmet. Really enjoying these Eclipse ones. I feel like all the Eclipse ones we've seen have been like black and red though. Are they all like that? Or are they just different? Or we just happen to find the teams that are these colors. Interesting. And all right, Zach Moss here. Autograph Mini Helmet Eclipse Alternate version here for Chris's collection. So with that, that does it here. Very quick rip on these mini helmets. But you know what? I had a lot of fun and I, I really like the mini helmets. They're just, for me, they're like the perfect size to put anywhere. I have a few unsigned ones, just some regular helmets for the Buccaneers. So I think they're pretty neat. So here we go, Zach Moss now for Chris. So thank you so much, Chris, for letting me open up some football for you here. I know not traditionally the football we open, but hey, it's football. So I hope that you enjoyed it and love this new Zach Moss autographed mini helmets addition to your collection. All of you out there watching, I know this video was very, very quick, but I hope you enjoyed it. So if you did, don't forget to go ahead and hit that like button. Comments for me, leave those down below. Let me know, am I just dumb? Are all the Eclipse ones just black? Are they all like that? Because we've seen, I know we saw, I think it was a Cardinals one. And then what else did we see? Was it a Raiders one maybe? I don't know. It's It's been a little bit since I saw the other ones. I can visualize the colors. I just don't remember which helmets they were. 
but let me know if they all are just the black and red for the most part. And of course, any other comments for me, go ahead and leave those down below. And of course, if you're not yet part of the Titan Cards family, we'd love to have you join us. Make sure you go ahead and hit that subscribe button. Also, before getting on out of here and into our third and final opening of the night, we'll be switching gears from football over to some Game of Thrones for Jim. So if that sounds interesting for you all, make sure to stay tuned. That video will be coming in a little bit. Uh, I do have to give a big shout out to all of our channel members. Thank you so much, you all, for going above and beyond with your support. It's Bossman, and I truly do appreciate it. Do have 13 Black Label fans. Anden, Bounty Hunter Breaks, Chris Rivers, Devon, Epicenter Gaming, Fails Tales, Kira Sotari, Mark Mordini, Mike Clotis, MT, Sean F., Stephen Olivo, and Stephen Bly. We also do have eight Gem Mint fans. Marco Verr, Dusty Archuleta, JH Geek, Michael C., Michael Bigelow, Scorecard Collectibles, Shinep Zen, and William Hastings. Thank you so much again to all of our channel members. And all members do have their names shown on screen at the end of every video. But as I was saying, that does it for me here tonight on football. Switching gears to some Game of Thrones up next. So thank you so much for watching, everybody. Take care, stay safe, and I'll catch you all in the next video. Bye!